Marines lead the way in combat, but we could not be the fighting force we are today without the energy that powers us both on base and on the battlefield. Marines must use their resources conservatively so we can remain effective in our missions and resilient to adversity. We must all put value on the Marine Corps energy ethos and alter our behavior in garrison and on deployment. Energy ethos is the shared commitment to the efficient use of energy resources. Unit energy managers are assigned to generate awareness of the Marine Corps' energy ethos and to act as a liaison between the installation energy manager and your commands. Over 100 UEMs have been assigned throughout the region. UEMs throughout MCI East have successfully impacted their unit's mission effectiveness by taking initiative and being proactive in their roles. As part of my duties, I attend a quarterly UEM training that has equipped me with the skills necessary to make a difference within my unit. I enlisted the help of a fellow Marine to aid me in this process, and together we were able to reduce our unit's energy consumption by identifying and correcting discrepancies. Upon reviewing our energy consumption reports, we noticed several of our buildings within the command were consuming excessive amounts of energy. After meeting with the installation energy team, we learned how to widen our scope and identify issues that have been overlooked in the past. Since then, we have identified and corrected a major issue with one of the HVAC units and updated light switches with motion sensors. In order to educate the Marines and sailors within our battalion, We've added a class to our annual training, which is a major reason for the success of this program within our unit. I ask all UEMs and each individual Marine to replicate the efforts of these warriors and to make changes within your own unit. Energy ethos and the unit energy program must be prioritized by all Marines. Leaders at all levels must set the example and talk to their Marines about energy. They must meet with their UEMs to discuss their unit's energy consumption and they must empower these leaders through your support of the program. Installation commanders must make reducing energy waste a top priority. It's through these efforts that we will ensure mission success and the future of our Corps. While leadership and unit energy managers make a huge impact to reducing energy waste, it is crucial that those that consume energy, all Marines, take action. Reduce energy and water waste. Find out who your UEM is and see how you can contribute to energy efforts in your unit. Having a conservative attitude in regards to resources while in garrison will translate onto the battlefield and could potentially save lives. Resupply convoys are vulnerable to attack. Minimize the risk, reduce your use. You have the power to save lives. The less energy dependent we are, the more lethal we will be on the battlefield. Not just today, but in the future. All Marines, from recruits at our depots to commanding generals, must do their part and support the UEM program and the Marine Corps' energy ethos. You have the power to make a difference in the future of our Corps.